There's just so much. They I'm overwhelmed. Oh yeah. My my. Jen, welcome back to my channel. Hi. <laughs> totally made Ariana do that. Yes, we have Ariana in the house. We're gonna head into Tokyo today. Yes. Yeah, so first we might try what? The, the world's strongest matcha flavored ice cream. Ooh, can't wait. We're gonna the next door, NYX. NYX store. They just opened a flagship store in Japan. We're gonna go there and look at some makeup, so. See if we can find a shade for our pale skin. Yeah, yeah, we're... Do I look whiter than you these days? <laughs> yeah. Ghost problems. <sighs> Ghost problems. Here you go, BB. Thank you! Some omiyage. Mmm, Ariana got me something from Kochi. Can I open it? Yeah. Okay. What are these things? What are these? Those are just like some extra, so I guess we're on the theme of matcha today, or matcha, uh. because these are some like matcha chocolates uh. with some regular chocolates inside. Mm. Why? Flashback to me trying to open things. <laughs> <laughs> no, not totally yucky. But like they're like a little cake. They look like the really fluffy, fluffy pancakes. Oh, you know those I mean? they jiggle, the, they stamp the jiggling it? ones. It uh, almost looks cheesecake. like that. They're cheesecake. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I mean. Is there anything inside mm. though? Is it red bean? White bean? White bean. I love anything bean. Thanks, baby. You're welcome. Mm -hmm. Anything for you. I think today might actually be St. Patrick's Day. There's Ireland flags hanging. Why would we come to Tokyo? Oh, yeah, God, no. On St. Patrick's Day. Uh. Okay, we're in Hanajuku now. Thank you. Woo! That's a pole. I tripped on that pole before. <laughs> like, did you go like full on? Into yeah, it? yeah. Like, I was on the phone. It's always so busy in Harajuku, but definitely a must see if you ever get here. We're on the way. Da, da, da. I'm so excited. Oh my god, I see it. We're on the way to NYX. And I think they have a huge billboard of Nikita, Dragoon, Mother of Dragons. I love her. I should have Googled like their top products to look for it. I don't know. I don't know. What are we gonna do? There's just so much. They I'm have overwhelmed. A soft matte lip cream. Ooh. That's a nice color. I wonder like the price difference between here and Canada, you know? Right. I bet it's real expensive, isn't it? Mm, maybe. NYX is like the affordable brand though. I think I read online that the finishing powder here is pretty good. So we have Samantha, fellow Canadian. Makeup by Shayla. There she is. Okay, Nikita. I think maybe this is the powder they're talking about. Ugh, I'm overwhelmed, but it all oh, looks I like so nice. That. Ooh. So this is kind of more yellow, and this is more pink. Mm hmm. And I think I'm more of like a light pink, pink like an alabaster. Damage has been done. These little small bags cost so much. Yeah. How much did you spend? I spent about 4,500. Yeah, I think mine was 3,200. We're going to Ariana's favorite place. Uh, Honestly, I'm probably gonna get what I always get, which is this, the grilled chicken tostadas. I love these. And they're only like 800 yen. They're pretty filling. This street is just so charming, right? Am I right? So nice. Okay, we finished lunch and we're on the way to Nanaya Aoyama. Aoyama. Nanaya Aoyama. Nanaya Aoyama. Nanaya Aoyama. I royally messed that up. <laughs> but yeah, they're the place that has like the strongest green tea ice cream that you can get in the world. There's nice. like seven levels. Mm. And I think we're gonna have to try seven or Yeah. Seven. Oh yeah, go big or go home. We've arrived at Nanaya Aoyama. Yes. I couldn't read that one. What is that, what is that even saying? Oh my god, okay, let's go. The matcha gelato. Number seven is what we're gonna get. I'm gonna get this one. So you can get two types. I'm gonna get the number seven, the strong green tea one, and probably black sesame. 
there was no seats in the place, so we were like literally sitting, sitting on the stairs. Yeah, at this random place. So if anyone comes out, we gotta move. But I got, yeah, the number seven matcha and black sesame. I love black sesame, anything. And Ariana got? I got the number one matcha, which is considered like the regular matcha you can get anywhere, and the number seven, because I wanted to compare. Look at the difference in color. Number seven, number one. <laughs> Okay, generic. It tastes more like vanilla-y oh, than really? anything, yeah. Mm. It's not matcha at all. Number seven, the strongest matcha in the world. <laughs> oh yeah, it's like, it's like bitter. Oh really? Yeah, but it's like yummy. I like matcha, so it's really good. It tastes like when you go to a sado like tea ceremony, mm. and like they whisk you the matcha tea. It's like a frozen form of that. Ah. I'm gonna try the most bitter one first. Actually, no, black sesame, I lied. It's already on my spoon. Oh my god, I love black sesame. Black sesame always reminds me of peanut butter. Is that weird? No. Oh, so good. It's that nutty flavor. Mm. Now, the moment of truth. Oh yeah, that's bitter. That's so bitter. It does taste like the tea ceremony kind. Yeah. But like two times more bitter. It's almost, yeah, creamy. It is a gelato. Mmm. Different. I don't think I could eat like a whole thing of that though. No? Yeah, I'm glad I got like two, two kinds. I'm gonna mix them together and it might be the perfect balance. Maybe I should've just gotten like number five. <laughs> <laughs> But like it gives it the sweetness if you mix them together. Mm. Mm, the black sesame is just so good. Are they? Those people were just poking out the window looking at us. Oops. Mm -hmm. Ariana's finishing mine. I can't believe. Well, like it is strong, but it's yummy. Mm. I would say there's a reason why, like number five is popular among. For mm. sure. It's it's strong. It's more like the aftertaste is like bitter. I feel like chalky. It's still good. I mean, it's a good experience. Guys, let's say bye to Ariana. Coming back home. Mm. I'm see exhausted you. from shopping. Yeah, I'm freaking like look at those bags. Anyway, we'll see her next time she comes. We're on the train. So bye. bye. So I'm back home now. I forgot to fill you guys in. Currently cooking. I'm in the process of making this. I have severely misjudged and made way too much. I absolutely love this side dish. It's called, like this vegetable that's being used. It's called gobo brown rice, edamame, kotu jampo. This is like an instant cheese duck galbi. Mm. OMG. So yeah, that was way too much dinner. So that's gonna be probably eaten tomorrow as well. I am wiped. I think I only slept like four hours last night. We went and played games, um, which you've probably seen in the last vlog. So I went to bed late because I showered and then didn't really sleep well last night. Anytime I have any little bit of alcohol, whether it's a little bit or a lot, I just never sleep well. I don't know why I'm like awake early right away. So I've been awake since like 6.30 a.m. And I am so tired. White. White! I had a great day with Ariana though, but um, yeah, her and I were just so dead. Like, we went to your conversation, which I didn't film, and we looked at like, I don't even know, seven different stores so Ariana could try to find a leather jacket. And she didn't find any that she liked anyway, so um, yeah, I didn't film any of that. And on the train ride back, we were so silent. We were both just like, because we're just so tired. So she went back home and I came here and you guys see and I made dinner and I have so many videos to edit. Like I'm so behind because my computer wouldn't turn on because of the charger. By the time you guys are watching this, I'm sure all seven videos would have been released or something like that. If not all, then some. But I'm just so far behind. Like, yeah, I have seven videos to edit. <gasps> Wish me luck. Also, apparently there was a fairly big earthquake today. Um, my stepsister messaged me being like, oh my god, are you okay? I just got like a notification. Um, she's in South Asia right now. Um, and I was like, what? 
So I messaged T and apparently there was a big earthquake. I didn't feel it though because like Ariana and I were walking around so when you're walking around you can't really feel an earthquake as much. It was like a 4.8. And I'm back without makeup on. I forgot. I didn't show you guys what I bought at NYX. Um, well, maybe some of you don't want to see but I'm going to show you anyway. Can you hear my voice leaving me like, I better not be getting sick. <laughs> It'll be what, my fourth time this season? Like, go away. I have one week left of work. Ah! Anyway, okay. So, the first thing I picked up is this brush from NYX. It is their no number brush, 16. It's the NYX number 16 brush. It is such a beautiful blending brush to use, like, in your crease. I haven't decided if I want to use this for eyes or face yet. And then I picked up the NYX uh, butter lipstick love it like Ariana picked up the more pink nude and I picked up the more peach nude because Ariana likes pinks and I like oranges and peaches the applicator is different how it's like plastic like that you just twist it up and it comes up it's so pretty the lipstick was 800 yen which is about eight dollars I don't know how much NYX products are in Canada um, or America like compared to yen I wonder if it's more expensive because I know when I checked Kiehl's face toner it was like 4,000 yen, about $40 when you can get it for like $20, 2,000 yen in Canada. Just saying. And then I picked up a pot concealer from them. My Etude House concealer has a dofa at the end and I find it like, I can't control it um, as well and I have to like put it on my finger and then put it on my face. So I want to be able to spot conceal better. So I decided to get the NYX Full Coverage Concealer. I think this one was about 1,000 yen or 1,200 yen, so 10 to 12 dollars. Thank you so much for watching this video. Don't forget to follow Ariana on her social media platforms. I'll link them all down below as well as yeah girls. Tell me down below what is your favorite flavor of ice cream? Oreo Cheesecake Blizzard from Dairy Queen. Like that is my jam. That's my favorite flavor of ice cream. Let me know yours down below. Thank you so much for watching guys and I'll see you in my next video. Good night.